Um, hey, I'm Elias. It's Tom with the Life of Laney, back with another box from CPC. And this one should be full of Silver Age goodness. Uh, respecting, not our best box, but this should be a respect, respectful box, I believe. Yeah. As far as the titles. Don't know the grade yet. Yeah. The last video I uploaded on YouTube, I watched like the first couple seconds of it to see what I should like title the video. Mm -hmm. And you were like, this is going to be Silver Age Goodness. So I titled it Silver Age Goodness. It was all 80s books. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oops. <laughs> I went back and read the comics on the comments and I was like, uh oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. First, we have a Blue Bolt Volume 9, number 6, well, 70. I screwed up. This is Golden Age. Yay. Goodness, this is from 1948, <laughs> so they have a 7-0 in a book that's from 1948. It's pretty so impressive. It's all about football? Huh? It's all about football? It's about... Or a guy that's fast? The guy, yeah. <laughs> One with Dick Cole. Dick Cole, what a great name, as he scores in this 52-page issue. Packed with action. I bet they called him Richard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, who wants to go through life known as Dick? Okay. I actually worked with a guy whose name was Richard Hunt. Really? I had... Dick Hunt? Yeah, Richard Richardson was his last name. Dick, Dick, Dick Richardson? Dicks. Okay, so... I think we're pretty much done with that. Oh, okay. We're pretty much done with that. Okay. Next we have, well, this is kind of ironic, a ginger number one <laughs> and a one mate. But the female ginger, not the Ethan type of ginger. Oh, is this like Archie comics? Uh, well, yeah, she was, um, she was like... Betty and Veronica before Betty and Veronica really started getting big. Yeah, it's like the she same was, lettering as Archie. Yeah, it's totally Archie comic, Archie Publications, and oh, she okay. was totally was in, she's in the Archie universe. So that's Betty, or no? No, no, it's Ginger. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so, again, more Golden Age goodness. This is from 1951. 1-8, light tan to off-white pages. George Freeze cover and art. Looks pretty good for a 1-8. Yeah, I think so. We've had worse. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Um, next we have an Astro Boy number one at a 3 0. Okay, this one should be Silver Age. Oh, okay, we're getting Silver. I was trying to figure them out by the titles. 65. So, yeah, we're definitely right into it. This is the first anime comic book, basically the first Japanese animation story to come here so and to go back there out. in comic book form. So, first appearance of Astro Boy, Astro Boy, this is the only issue they did. They just did this one and back up kind of cover. Now see, to me, especially with this book being 20, 15 years older, this book, this book to me, Ginger. Looks better. Can we see the camera? Okay, no, I'll here. put them together. I know. <laughs> okay. But I, I just think, I think Ginger looks better than that. And this is a 3-0. Yeah. This book's was, filthy. Was that a white comic cover or was it kind yeah, of yellow? Off-white. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, it was the same back too, isn't it? Yeah, but... And Astro Boy took off, though, didn't he? Like, he got pretty popular? He was pretty popular. I've never probably really heard of him before. Yeah. Okay, now we're getting into superhero stuff. We have a Batman 181 at a 6-0. One of my favorite, favorite Batman covers. This is the first appearance of Poison Ivy. I've owned... I've been fortunate enough to own probably 10 of these, and I've owned them the high as an 8-0. Uh, but I'm glad to have this back in my collection. This one's going to stick with me for just a little while. Because I got some more coming. We have a Daredevil number two at a two two point five. Yellow suit, Daredevil. A second appearance of Daredevil and Electro. Fantastic Four appearance in it as well. Second appearance of Electro. Wow. Yeah. It was in Daredevil. That's kind of cool. Yeah. Um. So he, he, you know, it needs to be cleared up. But I love these old these old covers because there's so, so much, much stuff going, going on yeah. in it. You can just look at it for five or ten minutes. I guess it's back in the day when you still judged a book by its cover, but... And I love all the words, too. Like, the guest storm and the... Yeah, we've got something to say. Mm-hmm. And the new ones, they just don't really do that. No, they don't, they don't have the... The word bubbles. Yeah. Okay, next we have a Captain America 117 at a 4.0. Oh, this is a good book. This yeah. is a first, first appearance. appearance of Falcon. Yep. Origin of first appearance of Falcon Sam Wilson and Red Wing, Red Skull appearance, Modoc cameo. And Red Wing... That's his little, like, oh, okay, see, in the movies, they made it like a little um, robot. Right, but this was an actual Falcon in the comics for, yeah. for a long time. Oh, uh, he had cool. a red wing hung out with him. I didn't even know that. But see, again, I mean, that's 4-0. Astro, well, anyway, it doesn't, it doesn't really matter, but <laughs> it just seems like this this should be a lower grade, in all honesty, yeah. but still, great book. 
really happy to have it. Next we have a X-Men 14 at a 3.5. Okay, so I believe this is First Sentinels. Yeah, First Sentinels. Uh, important villain in the X-Men universe. Great with the classic team coming through the window there. That's it's kind of funny. It's like Angel Beast. The north wall. Yeah. You know, like they're coming through a wall, but legitimately. Well, I think they're shooting. I think they're shooting a scene or something. Oh, really? Oh, okay, yeah, that's actually really cool. Yeah. And the Sentinel or Sen Sen Sentinels. Sentinels are in the movies, right? Or going to be? Yeah, Sentinels, Sentinels are the big robots that, that, that uh, in the movies, it would be the one where Peter Dinklage's character created those robots that took over everything. Mm. That's, that's them. Yeah. So, it doesn't really look like a robot here, but that's a robot. <laughs> Next we have Amazing Spider-Man 101 at a 4.0. Oh, another key first appearance. Uh, first appearance of Morbius. Uh, the Living Vampire, Dr. Michael Morbius, Liv Lizard, I almost said liver. Lizard <laughs> appearance, last 15 cent issue. Yeah. So. That this, movie was horrible. It was really bad, but it's a great cover, great first appearance. <laughs> but yeah, the movie we could was redo awful. it. Okay, we have Iron Fist number one at a 7 up. Oh. Lastly. Beautiful, beautiful looking 7 0, I think. 1975? Yeah. Pretty good. And uh, a great cover. I love this with, with Iron Fist hitting Tony Stark right in his uh, heart. Thing. What, what was that called? Um, I'm thinking about it. Ah, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, anyway, I know what you mean. So that was pretty Hello. cool. Hello. How you doing? I'm doing fine. So. Arctic arc. Wait, no reactor. The arc reactor. reactor. His, his arc reactor <laughs> punched him right in it. So arc pretty cool. So okay. Well, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you digging through the log boxes. Hey allies, thanks for watching. Make sure to leave a like and a comment if you want to. Please hit the subscribe button and follow us on Facebook. For a bunch of updates, we do Facebook live sales almost every Thursday. Pops, comics, toys. We are now selling on Whatnot, also doing auctions on Whatnot. Follow us on TikTok. We post a bunch of funny videos. A lot of the new stuff that comes through in the store goes on TikTok. Our comics, our toys, everything on TikTok. And lastly, follow us on Instagram. We mostly repost on Instagram all the other stuff for updates. And you guys have a good day. Bye.